Hey, what is going on guys? My name is Lewis and I'm really excited because Rockstar have given us some new information about GTA 5 on new gen and PC and it's information about the transfer of content uh, to do with our online data, uh, our characters, new content that's going to be exclusive to new gen and PC and it includes some throwback GTA content from returning vehicles and it, it, some of the stuff that's in it and the new screenshots that Rockstar have released for them which will be in the screen over the gameplay as well is really really awesome they look really detailed the world looks more alive the information they've given us as well is just mind-blowing it's really unexpected I did, I did not expect this at all um, I'm not going to go through all of the information because there is a ton of it, but the link for the article will be in the description, so definitely go and check that out if you're looking forward to GTA 5 on new gen. It releases in three weeks, just three weeks. It's gone so quick. Um, but a brief overview of the information is there's going to be the Dodo Seaplane, which will return. That was found in Trailer 1 of GTA, for GTA 5 back in 2011. Some people may remember the Dodo Seaplane from GTA 3. You couldn't fly very well in GTA 3, but it was available in the game and was enterable. But as I say, you can't fly very well, but that will be returning. That is in one of the screenshots flying over Vespucci Beach near, well, by Pleasure Pier. There's going to be new events and rewards. So the Dodo Seaplane will, as I say, be returning. There will also be the Imponti Juco Death. Um, which is a vertible GTA classic, which you may remember the the, the, uh, the Duke from GTA 4. That was a really that was one of my favourite muscle cars. There's going to be new activities, which some people do know about, which will be in story mode, such as uh, Snapmatics. There will be little challenges which you can do as there'll be new wildlife. There is a murder mystery, um, and it says here as Michael, you follow a trail of cryptic clues to unravel. A grisly murder mystery, and if you put all the clues together, you unlock noir style filters uh, which allow Snapmatic to look like an old school crime classic uh, with that gritty feeling, which is pretty sweet. There's going to be new weapons such as the railgun and hatchet, um, really fun. There's going to be uh, pretty sweet with the railgun, it looks so advanced, like technology. It says this piece of experimental. Military technology also has its own set of shooting range challenges as well. Your local ammunitions will be there'll be shooting challenge shooting range challenges as well for activities. Um, further on, it says as well the the wildlife photography challenge. There'll be new animals in GTA 5 and new gen. So you'll be able to, as Franklin, go and find uh, animal species, take pictures and stuff. And if you, I think, if you unlock a catalogue of these animals and you find them, you unlock a new uh, crap. Kraken sub, I think that's how you say it. It's a Kraken sub. So it's a new submarine that's going to be in GTA 5. That is pretty dope as well. So we'll have a new submarine uh, with some challenges. There's going to be stock car races. So if you win all these, you win some of these races, you will unlock uh, muscle cars. There'll be new muscle cars and classic muscle cars. In the one screenshot, you'll see there's the gauntlet and the dominator. But also on the left of the gauntlet, there is a stallion. You may remember this version of the stallion from GTA 4 as well. So there's going to be more muscle cars returning from previous GTAs. Monkey mosaics. Um, there's going to be wall tags of monkeys around Los Santos. Uh, perhaps could even be in Blaine County as well. And if you track them all all the way and you get them and you find them and you complete this challenge, you will get a Go Go Monkey Blister, which will be exclusive to returning players. That is sweet. New vehicles and more. There will be the Chevel. Marshall monster truck and the new maneuverable blimp complement of zero gas um, I think it's zero just with an X that you may remember I think was also in GTA San Andreas um, I'm not sure if it was in GTA 4 as well, but I think it was in San Andreas for sure Rockstar also did a small Q&A session not gonna go too much into the Q&A session. You can read that for yourself but to be honest, it's really, really fun. The one thing I'm glad, though, that Rockstar have cleared up, and this is in the Q&A, is that you will only be able to transfer your GTA Online content once, and you will have your rank kept on your old console, 
and also be on your new console but they will rank up separately that's the way I expected it to happen I'll do a video more in depth on that soon but definitely check out this article if you want to see some new news and information about GTA 5 on PS4, Xbox One and PC with its exclusive content coming only to new gen on November 18th definitely worth checking out hope you enjoyed this video if you do please leave a like button hit the like button and leave a like if you didn't like it and you're not looking forward to GTA dislike the video tell me why in the comments and share this video around to make sure everybody all the people you know who are looking forward to GTA 5 know about this information because it's definitely definitely a copy of GTA 5 you want to be picking up because it's going to be a completely new experience hope you enjoyed the video and for now I shall see you in my next video